good bit of what television is all about is bringing people into houses all over the country. We try very hard to bring every kind of person who's in the news. We invite them in and try to learn more about them and thereby about all people. We've been so privileged to have some of the most fascinating, extraordinary people stop by our little studio. Entertainment has always been part of the show. Well, Harpo, I know you have many and varied interests, and the harp is only one of them. Look, when are you getting married, Mr. Grill? I'll just tell you what you do to imitate Betty Davis. It's very simple. Pizza! He went back and, and looked at the biggest stars of, of television, theater, and film. You'd be hard-pressed to find any who had not put an appearance in the today program. Well, the name of the movie is Star Wars. It is going to be one of the biggest money-making movies of our time, no doubt about it. I met all these people that I never in a million years imagined I would meet. From Harrison Ford. You're completely out of control. <laughs> Tom Hanks. Well, this is the first time you've plied me with alcohol. <laughs> Sandra Bullock. Sandra yeah. Bullock. Come back more often. No, not after this interview. <laughs> Muhammad Ali. And I say go with some one-two. Okay. Go. One-two. You will see it again. <laughs> George Burns. Coco Katie. Beautiful Katie. How cool is that? Channing. He's got his biggest mouthful. <laughs> Carol Channing. Still one of the most memorable interviews I've ever seen on the Today Show. Being interviewed by Jean Shallot. And we were both a puddle by the time she finished. What is that with you? Hold on, sorry. <laughs> I've been doing this for three hours already. Can we get today? a professional in here, please? <laughs> yes, 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 yes. I'll have what he's having. <laughs> Robin Williams, you didn't know what was going to happen. Hold on, let me see these questions. Okay, uh, no, on, give me those. No, no, wait. <laughs> Eight inches. All you knew was that your stomach was going to hurt when it was over. Say it, this ain't going to happen. So much because he did so much for our show. I used to love interviewing Miss Piggy. I mean, we had a little diva thing going. To this day, when Jim Carrey comes in, are you still, what's gonna happen? This just in, Matt Lauer's hair, one eighth of an inch and counting. <laughs> what kind of a journalist are you? For again. God's sakes, <laughs> cut, start over. One of my favorite guests was Will Ferrell. Quanto vivo solo suena horizonte foto de palabra. Pretty good. You were just about to kiss me, weren't you? So <laughs> 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 projects director. <laughs> <laughs> You've always wanted to I've do that. I've always wanted to and do that. And then that's your latest weather report. Here's what's happening in your neck of the woods. Bravo! You're just trying to let people see a side of them that maybe isn't seen very often. I must ask you the question that most Americans want to know about you. Are you happy? I suppose I have a certain peace of mind. This business of being difficult. Uh, is not is not true. I cannot imagine Elizabeth Taylor being told by a man that I've got some work to do, honey. Go upstairs and watch TV. I'm a very committed wife. <laughs> I should be committed too for being married so many times. The Tom Cruise Scientology interview. Everybody had this sense something was going to happen. But but aren't there Matt, examples where it Matt, works? Matt, Matt, Matt. You, you don't even you're glib. So many pinch myself moments. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Thank you, Bradley. Wow. I want you to relax for that. I'm trying. Relax. I got to talk to like the hunkiest men on the planet. That is one handsome man right there. <laughs> that really is. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, luck if you've ever been a lady to begin with. Ooh, be a lady tonight. Yeah. Let's talk about SWAT. I think you're okay. funny yeah. as well. I think I'm you're sure funny you too. Colin Firth for the King's Speech. I've always had a big crush on him. When you get the statue, I'll polish it for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, it's heavy, too. You know what? 
It, it's extremely difficult, but you really you take one for the team. I knew if I lived long enough, my dreams would come true, and they have. <laughs> to do this job, you have to just kind of forget that you're a super fan and just get your game face on. We can find a time during each show to bring you a person or an event that just makes you stop and sigh and smile. We think that's crucial to every broadcast. Wow. wow! That's pretty cool, right? That's Shortage very of cool. stars. <gasps> well, okay. look it's one of the reasons this job is so wonderful. And isn't it cool looking back at Barbara yeah, Walters yeah. and Jean yeah. Shalit and all the celebs from back then? Wow. Yeah. I still haven't forgiven you for putting Clooney in my seat. <laughs> I didn't put him in your seat. You went to the bathroom, he showed up. I didn't ask him to sit there. He was drawn to me magnetically. <laughs> and then he left very quickly. Tomorrow, actually, we're going to look at some of the biggest stories that we've covered over the past 65 years right here on Today. Mm. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.